fuck up. Shut the fuck up, Kyle. Hey, Kyle. Shut the fuck up, dude. Hey, yeah. Nobody likes you, Kyle. Fuck you, Kyle. Fuck Wait, you, dude. I'm Kyle? <laughs> Wait, you're Kyle? Imagine being a Kyle. Dude. That's L. L. I'm sorry. But, like, actually imagine being a Kyle or a Jessica. Yeah. Like, holy holy shit. shit. I feel so bad for those people. Like, literally. I actually do. It's the same as being a Karen these days. <laughs> if your but, name is Karen, you're doomed. But yeah. Uh... What, what if your name is Chab? You're destined to great things, my my boy. But yeah. What if, uh... what if my name is Big Guy? <laughs> but yeah, uh, welcome to uh, session number 22. Uh, I want a recap from... Oh, shit. What? Um, which recap? The ba the backstory one or the... No, the session before. <laughs> oh fuck, I don't remember that. Well, that's too bad, cause you Wait, gotta I do that. Why is it not with me? No, it's motherfucker. Ace. No, it's Ace. Okay. Oh, cause okay. Cause I didn't roll a one. Cause imagine rolling a one. Dude, okay, so. Well. Ah, my good friends. Yes. What happened last time? Well, let me tell you. Ace went down the stairs. <laughs> and then he met on a certain wolf person named Murmur. And they had a bit of a talk about not killing each other. And uh, they ventured in further into this dungeon looking thing they encountered uh, robotic flies or was it that? Uh, kinda yeah yeah okay that's what I got that's what I remember last session robot. and then they went further or the other direction and then Ace Decided to go in to a small opening. Before he realized, he uh, got dragged in and be was trapped for a moment. And wolf blood came, and uh, they all had a uh, sex party. But Ace turned into a vampire. Yeah, that's a big turn off, turn off for me. Yeah, and then uh, Ace needed to be invited out. Oh, yeah. So... <laughs> <laughs> yeah, vampires. So you basically told that the, the, the half, the, like the last half of the story, you told like everything, just the opposite of what it actually was. Yeah, which is an interesting tactic. <laughs> and so, uh, we decided that there is nothing more for us. Here, so we went back to the stairs and went down, and then we, I, Ace needed to be invited inside of one of the rooms, so he <laughs> couldn't invite himself. So Wolfblood had I, to do it but for I him. I could invite him on the dungeon. <laughs> That's interesting. I will be stuck here forever, and then in the last room, a fireball from this. Um, person, man, struck us, and then Echo snapped his neck yeah, Jesus. Okay, in one right. single oh, blow, yeah, true. dealing like, like one hit kill, dealing almost 50 damage. Because you crit or something. Yes. Yeah, it, it literally says in the chat, 16 plus 25. And oh, then... shit, dude. Yeah, that's insane. And then... It all, and they went to sleep, and that's all I remember. Yeah. Uh, yeah, you went to sleep, then you woke up, and then you went out of the hallway to go down. I think. No, we we like we fell asleep 
in the room downstairs from that room. Yeah, we we ended the session by sleeping. Yeah, there's a room like there's there's the cabinets that oh, yeah. we like opened and the tools and stuff. Oh, yeah, I sleep on top of here. <laughs> yeah, and then you were gonna go. Also, I can't see anything. So I'm legally blind apparently. What? No, you're not. Yes. Open it. There we go. It was just far away. Uh yeah, and uh, you, you were you were head you no you you, you did you oh. sleep and then you were gonna head down. Head down. Yeah, but, yeah, but we yeah. didn't head down yet. Oh. Also, I'm I'm full health again. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah. I can just hear me that spirit leaving his body every time I say that. All right. Um, I need I'll... to heal myself. <laughs> yeah. And uh, which one of us wake up first? Uh, you wake up first. Okay. I, um... Uh, wake up, take in my surroundings, and I... Oh, yeah, by the way, there's no doors anymore. The fireball kind of just removed them. Yeah. Uh, but when you wake... When you wake up, you hear this sort of scraping on the floor. And... It's it, it it it's the it's the scraping of floor and some kind of metal and it's coming closer to you. I walk over to Ace and you heard heard a step like, <laughs> but not no it, it, it it's not going fast but you know you're hearing. <laughs> yeah, I walk over to Ace. Yeah, I see how he's doing. Yeah, Ace is you know, Ace is Ace is doing kind. Of, Essence is pretty decent. He healed 7 HPAs. Walk out into the hallway. Yeah. Um, Ace, take a uh, perception check. Uh. Uh. It's always fun. Anyone? Yeah, you actually wake up from the sound as Mormon like, as you see Mormon like checking you, and then one way you wake up. Stretching out, yes, and healing myself, of course. Cure light wounds, it will be. Yeah. Say, uh, I just pop in the corner and say, Ace, yes, lay down. Yeah, give me a second. Okay, there we go. And as you begin to walk up, what you encounter when you when you walk down is a goat. What? <laughs> yeah, a goat. But what does he actually see? Uh, yeah, you see uh about uh he's like a goat man, um, goat's legs, goat's head, completely black fur, about seven feet tall. Um, very muscular man torso with quite pale skin. Um, he's got six horns, uh, glowing eyes, fingers ending sharp spikes rather than like regular claws or fingernails. Um, uh, his eyes glow slightly red, uh, covered in occult tattoos, and his forearms seemingly having like cracks in the skin with slight amber glow coming out of it. Um, yeah, this goat man is uh, scraping his uh, big old sword against the floor. And walking towards you guys. Say, <coughs> HALT! Is that a goat? <laughs> Who are you? What well, can I say the same for you? I'll start then. I'm Morom, former druid of the druidic cycle here in this local area. Just behind me is Ace. We're both adventurers who came into this dungeon seeking and resolve to our mission. Now, it's your turn, I believe. The name is Morgenstern. And 
As of right now, I don't think you need to know a lot more than that. Alright, and we're getting started. So what's your mission anyway? Well, we are uh, hunting someone down. Put it like that. You see, I think I might be able to help you there. I have, a, I have a theory as to we might have some similar enemies, the two of us, seeing as you're in here and I'm in here. Alright, uh, well, um, Ace, why don't you take over the talking? I'll go scout, scout the area ahead. Uh, oh, yes. Oh, hello there. <laughs> Just to squeeze past Mario Stone at a... Wait, are you large now, by the way? Oh, yeah. Uh, no, no, I'm a medium size right now. Yeah. Wait, you can change size, fucker? Yeah. Motherfucker. <laughs> Can't you? Yeah, I, technically, I can, yes. Imagine not being I, able I, to change I, size. I... Imagine not being able to change your size, dude! Ah! Okay, I'm gone now. Yeah. Yeah. Don't worry, I'm getting cut out. Uh, you see this uh, elf approaching. Uh, he has kind of. Uh, he, does, does, he, does he have a suit? Like. Does yeah, he... you could you could say that. <laughs> <laughs> it tore. It's, it's, it kind it kinda of looked like a suit. <laughs> Not a little bit torn up. Yeah. Quite. Uh, yeah, they, scrapped up suit. You, you can describe yourself. Ah, oh, well, Ace. Well, <sighs> So? How did he look again? No, never mind. Uh, he has... So, you see this elf around... Uh, uh, around six feet. Well, not... He seems fit, but not... Well, built. But... Yeah, he has a brown, he has brown hair, uh, quite sharp features on his uh, face. Um, <clears throat> fuck, yeah, uh, his hair is, uh, his hair is quite uh, beginning to grow out, beginning to be a bit long, yeah. and uh, he has a beard, yeah. Yeah, that's my description. <laughs> I've been interrupted so much now. Yeah? Yeah. Uh, do you guys like... Uh... I, I, I see that he's an elf and, uh, you know, courtesy, I speak in elven to him. Uh, so... You're the one just uh, talking to you then? Yeah. Then I guess it's you I'll make a deal with. Oh, what kind of deal? Well, you know, a little bit of I help you, you help me type deal. Oh, why of course. Oh yeah, uh, by the way, Ace, you see this guy is carrying the same sword that Jack Bowman was carrying. Oh, Bob. The same big hunk of metal. And you see that he's like holding it in the same, lead, same kind of straps. Are you holding? You know, it, are you holding nine degrees or in like in, in on the back, like on, uh, on tilted? No, I just have it like at my hip. Yeah. No, you don't, because the sword is six feet tall. No, no, but he's using the the the, the thing the thing that got made for you. You know, so you can have it oh, at your yeah. hip. So he's using, oh, you see everything. Okay, 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 yeah. okay. I see. I see. Yeah. Granted. How do you recognize that sword? Where did you find it? Well, I found it a bit ago, further up here. Was it over a dead corpse? Well, might have been. <sighs> well, I guess. 
Well, I, th I guess you could use it for some good, but... Never mind. Well, the deal. Ah, uh, yes, deals. I like those. So, so Lucifer Morningstar, what deal do you have for me today? Well, uh, first off, that's not my name. Uh, it's Morgenstern. Uh, second off, uh, I assume there's a there's a woman you don't fancy too much by the name of Tirana. You know that sly bitch. <laughs> oh. Oh, I have I encountered her before, and uh, she's tricked me and my former group. As you can see, I'm the only one left, except now you recruit Wolfblood. Well, you see, thing is, she sort of double-crossed me too. And, uh, as any good businessman, I'm here to exact my vengeance, give her a punishment, I guess you could call it. Well, I guess we have the same uh, motive then. Well, isn't but, that good? Yeah. I'm just wondering... What backstabbing thing did her, she did to you, do to you? Well, it's a long story, but all in all, it's a bit of a crossing the boundaries of a deal, you know, breaking a contract. And no one breaks a deal with me. Deals uh, should be kept and not be broken. Everyone needs to fill their part of the deal. Yeah. That's important. Very much so, and I, I must say, I'm not a huge fan of that dishonesty. So. Dishonesty, yes. Rule. Ace reaches hand, and, well... You can tell me more about the deal. You know? Um, I'm in. How... how joyous. I mean, what? So... How... how's about you? Catch me up. How, how's it going for you two? Traveling in it? Wait, wait, you cut out. What did you say? <laughs> How's about you? Catch me up to speed a bit. How's it going with you? Traveling in here and looking for whatever it is you're looking for. Here. My mission is to kind of eliminate her and return us, I could say, a relic of the past. Relic, yeah. Yeah. It's uh, said that it would stop great evil to be released, but for now I'm here for the revenge. I see, I see. I can just say after her encountering with her, I lost a lot of good people. Good I friends. See. I see how it is then. No, no easy we go in between the two of you. It's a quite a serious thing going on. Oh yes, and she's going to pay after tricking me. Oh, that's beautiful, beautiful. I like the sound of it. Yeah. <laughs> so, uh... What's the next move you're thinking of making? 
To be honest, I'm quite unsure. I have we haven't only the information I got is that she's in this dungeon, but I don't we haven't got any lead to where to go, so I've been kind of stuck wandering around. Well, I might know a little bit about how this place works. Now, don't get me wrong, I don't know the ins and outs of everything. But I, I have some general clues about. The coast is clear. We better move out now before some enemies show up. Alright. It's a deal then. Sounds like a deal to me. Hmm? Ace reaches hand and. Hey, grab your hand, shake yeah. on it. It's a deal then. Good. Um, yeah. Now that I've now that we made the deal, I'm going back to a larger size. Um, I grow from seven feet to about ten foot two. I hate these squares. Ah. Uh, 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 uh -huh. Uh -huh. Long ago. <laughs> Lady Dimitrescu. No? <laughs> it's me, Goat Wilman. Big Goat Wilman. Big Uber Goat. This is Victoria. But yeah, where do you guys proceed to go then? Mm. Well, where did the uh, wolf blood go? <laughs> yeah, where did wolf blood go? Did you follow the wolf blood? Yeah. yeah. Wolf blood? Yeah. Where did you walk to? I'm right around the corner. Plonk. Clonk. Um. Let's see. Uh, now that uh, now that I know that he's to be trusted a little bit more. Mm. I uh, take down my hood, and uh, he can see what I look like now. Yeah. Uh, as I take down my hood, you see a um, pretty good-looking human male. Uh, he has uh, black hair, uh, a black uh, moustache, uh, and uh, glowing red eyes. He almost has K9 features, like sharp teeth and uh, very pointy okay, nose, uh, long ears, stuff like that. Very thick eyebrows. Um, and he's uh, dressed in clothes that look like they were made from the trees and the bushes that were just outside. Yeah. <clears throat> so that's how it looks like, Morgenstern. Yeah. yeah. And I say, um, so, Ace, which way do we go? Do we backtrack or do we go up the stairs? Uh, there was also a door where you rested and down, if you didn't see that. You know, the, where, where, you, where you got yeah. attacked by a science guy. Yeah. I'm gonna walk here. here. Let's go. Like in here? Oh, there's a door here! Yeah. So it was like almost invisible, but okay. Yeah, sorry for that. I guess we're going in here now. Yeah. yeah. Oh god, I can I tried to open the door. I guess he just walked through it. No. Right. Yeah. You, uh, yeah. open the door. Uh, and... Clunk. What you see in there, what you see in there is, um... You find a... There was a there was a bad stench or there already, but you see you find yourself in this bad stench that surrenders and there's two rows of steel cages that line the center aisle 
and their thick bars of steel uh, glow softly in the half lit room. And each side, e in each cell, languishes a different monstrosity, slumped carelessly in piles of straw or, or its own filth. You see that in this, um, in this, um, in this room, it, there is like, it looks like the scientist has like combined different types of monsters. Ah, uh, uh, by the way, those yeah. they're locked. By the way, and oh, these are cages? Okay. yeah, and in these cages, like half basilisk, half like you know, you know, you know, little girl from Full Metal Alchemist. You know that turns into into a dog. Yeah, that's kind yeah. kind of like that. Um. Uh, well, well, I I kind of need help. Um, this was a whole lot worse oh, yeah, than I expected. Ace, come on in. Ah, thank you. Oh, such a kind person. I totally forgot. I'm sorry. It's just really new to me. Well, it's kind of new to me. I I really want to go in, but it's just no. I'll try to remember it going forward. And Morgan, sure, you were on your way here originally. Yeah. Well, fuck me. Because oh, you, is... you 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 were assigned to this place. Because you know. Yeah. Fucking. Well. So yeah, these are some abominations for your view and pleasure. Pleasure is uh, a strong <laughs> word. <laughs> 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 yeah, they're horrible. I go up to I go up to this cage that I'm looking at, like yeah. this one. You see a bas inside. you see a basilisk that has been. That looks like it's been like blinded, and as as you uh, as you go to the cell, it kind of like uh, backs off into the wall, like it's scared. Is the basilisk a juvenile or adult? Eh, it looks like an adult, but you see, how, uh, how big is this cage? <laughs> It's a basilisk is large, so it's, it just fits it. Okay, so it's like pressed in there. Yeah. Yeah. What um, type of experiment? I try to I try to reach out my hand towards him to give him some food. Oh, I don't think that's a good idea. Well, uh, you don't have to worry about my hand. It'll grow back. Yeah, no, I just, oh, I'm not a huge fan of feeding these abominations. Well, just, should probably just be killed off, if you ask me. I'm, uh, I'm a little bit of an abomination myself, so I can... Uh, oh, that's a weird way to introduce yourself. <laughs> you see, I'm, uh, you see, I'm not actually a druid. Uh, I was kind of born with the ability to turn into... <laughs> Which, uh, my uh, my uh, circle of druids called me Wolfblood, uh, Morom, which is the Druidic word for it. Yeah, it basically means uh, bringer of end times, I believe. So yes, they believe I am uh, the one who will make this world uh, erupt into volcanic flames. Okay, uh, I am, I'm the start of the beginning of the end. What does your name mean? Because I know. Oh yeah, and then... Uh, uh, Morom literally means wolf blood. Are you... Wait, what did you say your... It was again, your name. Morom means wolf blood. Oh. But yeah, by the way, um... Uh, like, there's only like two living abominations in the cage, the rest of it has like, it looked like they're like, died of, like, starvation. Yeah. I guess, uh, should I... How, how, how long ago did we kill that, that, the scientist? One day ago. Alright. Uh, I say to Morgenstern, why don't you guys just head to the door, I'll deal with these. Uh, 
Again, don't worry about me. Whatever they bite off will grow back. All right, then. You proceed to the next room? Yeah. Yeah. You, you go and open the door. And uh, in this room, uh, you see hundreds of planters and flower pots in stacks and row that dominates the whole room. And obviously it was once carefully organized, but since has it overgrown and been neglected. Uh, thick mats of ho uh, thorny green vines climb the walls and ceiling, and a carpet of moss and roots cover the floor. And the fountain on the east wall is carved to resemble an owl's head, belching a stream of glowing blue water into a basin. And a squared ring of trenching uh, filled with the same water dominates the center of the floor. Both are ch uh, ch uh, choked with lilies and other less identifiable plant matter. And um, you can take a. Uh, um, uh, as. Uh, you can take a perception as you walk into the room. Let's see. Let's find this guy. Uh, you you went as well, Ace? Not yet. Oh. Did Echo just oh, go? Perception. Yeah. Hi. <laughs> because she can go through the door like Ace, but I'm going to. I'm also going to walk the wolf blood. Oh. Perception. Oh, Holy. Great. Oh, oh, I gotta stop yeah. fucking. I gotta st stop the fucking messaging, though. <laughs> uh, as you go around, you see in the fountain there is a stone chest lying in the bottom of this fountain. Oh. So, like, here. I'm walking. I'm walking. I'm walking here. A bada bing, a bada boom, I'm walking. Yeah. A pancola. Wolf blood. Yes. I, I must ask, have I. Do I remember you for. Have I seen you before? No, I don't think so. You shouldn't be asking. Take an intelligence check. I remember something. I have to roll a bluff. <laughs> remember me and my bluffs, Milano? Steam? Yeah, you I mean he's familiar. Um, take it. Take a sense motive, uh, real quick. Um, Jesus, because... you can't lie for the, sh for the life of you. Where's... Five in bluff. <laughs> You know that you know he he's like nah I don't know you how could I know you? Whoa! Being a bit cryptic now, but I remember someone like you a while back when I was around forty. Do I have to roll the intelligence to see if I remember? Yeah. Oh shit! Ah! <laughs> like, <laughs> why is the music fitting? I rolled this to be in a two. <laughs> God damn it! God damn it! Um, you, <sighs> you like, you think you know him, but you're unsure. Okay. <laughs> Um, you, you need to I, you need to think about it later. I uh, hang on. I have to see if this is a uh, touch. Thing. I have to do it. Touchy, touchy, or is that just wishy, 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 wishy? Uh, I'm just curious, Sosa. Do you remember the name Damon Dark? 
for an intelligence? Mormon? What do you mean? No, Moron. Do, do we really have to pull the wrong intelligence? Yeah. That's like the, my entire character premise. You know who Damien Dark is. I just need you to get over five. <laughs> yeah. Okay. I, I try to bluff him. <laughs> <laughs> Ah! Come on, Ace! That's says Mortem! Yep. I've never heard that name. You're no. plus six, come on! Come on! Come on! No! Uh, You're like, uh, must have been the wrong guy then. Oh, must be. But yeah, when you hear the name Damien Dark, you're like, you're like, you make that, you know, you make that sound when you swallow? <laughs> yeah, you're like, shh! Fuck does he know that? I'm only I'm the only one that's supposed to know that fuck that is. I uh, use my charm animal, extraordinary ability. Yeah? On the basilisk. Which has a DC of uh what's my wisdom modifier is? Uh, does it count as a spell? Uh hang on. It's level Yeah, no. It just says I can charm the animal. It doesn't say anything about it counting as a spell. Mm. It's the same as the charm animal spell, but for me it's a it's an ability. What's the DC? It is uh, fifteen. Uh, okay. Let me get my dice, my dice, where the fuck's my dice, where's my dice? Fifteen? Yeah. Ooh! Uh, it looks like it did not work. Ooh, fuck. But yeah, he's like, Psh, I don't, I don't know what you're talking about. And then it goes like, Psh, there's something, it's, it's best, this doesn't seem like anything happened. But yeah, uh, Morgenstern, what do you do? Um, what was it that was in over here again, exactly? A stone chest, about... About two feet wide, four feet wide, possibly. I want to I wanna, I wanna check if it's locked first. Just like, you, feel the lid if it's locked. You, um... It is, in fact, not locked. Oh yeah, no open it. Yeah, as you open it, you see a pair of gauntlets in the chest. Oh. But as you dip your hand in the water, uh, I'm gonna need you to take a. Yeah, as you as as uh, you dip your hand into the water, you notice that it's. Kind of, uh, it's spi you know that it's spicy water, mm. and uh, you take um, uh, eight acid damage. Oh. So I, I think you just quickly like open it, and then you see the gauntlets. Oh baby, oh, fuck, eight damage. Uh, let's go. Let's see. Yeah, I want to try to grab them. I can, I can get them. Yeah. As you grab them, you take mm -hmm. you take another sixteen damage from the acid. But you get them out. Damn. Oh fuck me. Yeah, you got. Is there anything cool about the dump looks? Uh, take a. Uh, you wanna try? You wanna try? You wanna try to appraise them? Yeah. Let's see. I keep sending you whispers. I. How do I end this? How do I end this curse? Holy shit! Dude. How do I end the curse of having eternally sending you my balls? Oh yeah. Uh, I forgot to turn that off. <laughs> I've been cursed. No, 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 I, I fix, I fix. 
I have been cursed with secrecy. PC, public role. Um, yeah. Uh, you know that these are very good condition gloves, even though it was in the ch in the chest. And you um. think that there's something more to it other than, you know, it's them being... Gauntlets, actually. It's gauntlets, not gloves. Gauntlets. Yeah. You think there's something else to it. Hmm. But you don't know what. Maybe it's magic, maybe it's something else. Huh. I'm gonna put them in my in my bag, I think. Yeah, you're... Put them in the bag. Yeah. How much do they weigh? One pound? Two pounds? Two pounds? Alright. But yeah, um... Wolf Blood and Ace. What's popping? What do you what do you do after the charm animal fails? Uh, I uh, I look I look at this basilisk straight into the eyes. You see that it doesn't have eyes. He doesn't have eyes at all? No, that's the reason you're not being like turned to stone because he's been blinded. Yeah, okay. No eyes. Uh, <laughs> Um, well, Ace has been stoned before, so... <laughs> um, Twice? I, uh, I... Can I touch the tail of this animal? Mm, you, you, need, you see that you need to get into it, because he's, like... He's, he, he's like, basically, like... He's, he like, he, he's, like, not letting you touch him at all. Okay. Um... Would you say he is able to study me even though he doesn't have eyes? Do you think that he has developed some kind of other senses because he's lost one sense? Maybe his other senses have been... So that's a yes to the studying? Yeah. Okay, I cast Wild Empathy. Which uh, is basically a diplomacy check, but for animals. Okay. So I roll, I roll a d20, I add my Lycanthrope level and my Charisma modifier. Yeah. So that is the plus seven. So I go. Well, seven. you've seen Bessie, so I guess we'll leave you for now. Yeah, it is not improving. Nothing is improving with him. And while I do that, you go into the room, and when you head into the room, uh, I can't head into the room. Why can't you enter the room? You know. I can't. But the door is not closed. It's it's open. They were open from. Yeah. They were. No, it, it was never closed. But I need to be invited. True. Do you? If this is some van prison thing, it's only to be. Uh, you yeah. only need to be invited into a home. Yeah, because it, it's only when someone lives in that area. Yeah. But Tehran You don't have to be invited here. into every room. You only need to be well, invited yeah, into a building. Tehran, Tehran owns this entire dungeon. Yeah, but if you're not okay, so at least in folklore, vampires work like you get invited into a building, then you can roam the building freely. All the rooms count as separate, like homes. What? Yeah. Yeah, that's vampire. That's that's, that's fucking vampire. stupid. Because one single thing lives there, and it's you know, their own. That is the. St yeah. But other people so. can invite other uh, vampires in, because. It, it, it counts as a home, but it's for the first person that enters it, because it's a dungeon. <sighs> I know, I know. I read this, okay? I read this. I'm kind of stuck. What do you mean, the door's wide open? Just invite me inside. Oh no. You tell me, why is it I have to invite you in here? Why is it that you can't just walk into a room? Oh, please tell me he's a vampire hunter. <laughs> <laughs> that would be fun. Well, you see... Sense motive. <laughs> Before I speak. 
What are you trying to sense? I tried to, uh, yeah, uh, nothing. <laughs> nothing, yeah. Nothing? <laughs> nothing. Nothing. Hmm. Well, uh, as you see, I... It appears I have been cursed. Well, that's what they all say, isn't it? Alright, all right, I'll, I'll, I'll let you in. Come on in, mate. When, you wanna enter? Oh, thank you, friend. As you see, he's like, yeah, he steps in. I remember what I told you about dishonesty earlier. Yeah? I give you a really, really mean look. I, I, you know, you know, show off my sharp teeth and all. Yeah, all my teeth are sharp, by the way. And, uh, there's like a fire burning inside of my mouth. A faint glow from the back of his throat, as he talks. Yeah. Well, I wasn't dishonest about being cursed. Dishonesty includes not telling the full truth. Well, you didn't ask. And... <sighs> You're a fool. Don't test me again. Oh, interesting. Yeah, uh, from here you can see a door that leads upwards. Yoink is blowing. But this door is also open. Never mind, it was never closed. What's through here? Ah, what you see there is, in fact, uh, the outer wall of this room within a within a room are like you see you you get in here, and there is a room within a room, and in the center sits a uh, uh, a second smaller structure, a massive block of stone that rises near to the ceiling. Across the sides flow, flow horizontal bands containing thousands of minuscule engravings, and and it's reproduced on a larger two sets of bronze double doors that lead into the stone block from the east and west. Well, I'm still stuck. <laughs> oh, I love this curse, dude. <laughs> yeah. Uh, what, uh, what does Morgan Stern do? As he... I wanna, I, I'm just like perusing the thing. You said there were engravings? Mm. What sort of engravings are these? Mm, it's in a language you don't understand, actually. What? Yeah. It's those exist? <laughs> those exist. God damn it. <laughs> like a... Something? I know 12 languages. Yeah, there's more than 12 languages in Pathfinder, you idiot. I know, but like, still a decent portion of the Wait, languages. Wait, do you still have Sphinx? Uh, no. I okay. got rid of Sphinx. Wait, <laughs> Funk, fake. Okay, you can probably do Knowledge Nature if you have that. Let's see if I have that. Yeah, I think I do. <laughs> knowledge... <laughs> Uh, yeah, I have knowledge in nature, it seems. You put a rank into it? Oh. I have the knowledge in nature. Oh, yeah. Over, you, over, over, over. you actually yeah. notice that these are... Um, these carvings are a slightly different representation of a scarab beetle. Oh. A beetle. I is my favorite band. But yeah, it, and, you, and you see in the doorway, Ace is like standing there and it's like, you know, just watching. Okay, in here already. Yeah, thank you. Oh, what is this place? Well, there's beetles on the walls. Oh, there's a great band. But yeah, and you see two bronze doors on the left and right. I'm heading in. Strength check. 
Oh, strength check. Oh, strength. <laughs> well, that's quite a polite. I got open door. Wow, you dad. actually just got enough. <laughs> you take this this door and it's like, and you like, you just rip them open. And. And uh, in this room, in this side of small, is darkness interrupted by only a faintly glowing sarcophagus. Uh, apparently constructed entirely out of gold. Runes oh, shit. like uh those on the outer doors cover its surface, but these appear to skitter and dance across it. Um, I gotta turn medium real quick. You gotta turn what? Yeah, medium. I'm t uh, yeah, turn me medium real quick. Yeah, and I want you to take a, uh, you and Ace to take a will saving throw. Uh, let's see where the fuck I don't had. Wait. Where the fuck is that? On defenses. Okay, Fifteen. Defenses will. Oh yeah, is it a mind effect? Uh, Joinky is Maybe. <laughs> yeah, I get Ace, Ace is like, oh, I have a plus twenty-five on mind effects. Yeah, what's your plus on mind effects? Let me just check. <laughs> also, I'm uh, a vampire now, so I can't be mind affected. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> oh fuck, no! Uh... Do you have a plus fine for mind effects or something? What does mind effect count? Does it, does it count as enchantment? Enchantment, yes. Yeah, then I have plus two. Okay, you don't. Both of you don't make it. As as you see this uh, dancing beetles, you you become very very compelled to open this sarcophagus. Well, I can't go in. So. All right, boys. Good luck. Actually, you go. You go in. What? Yeah. Uh, you have been invited by the sarcophagus. No, and I don't. And both of you go on each. Uh, and both of you go on each side and strength check. No. Oh, strength oh, check, huh? It. What? Let's, uh, just, let's give ourselves minus in strength. <laughs> I mean, I rolled really bad. Yeah. Ace, you managed to open the sarcophagus. Oh, good. Uh, Morgan Stern, you um. You slip your fingers as you try to open this, but Ace like seems to like open it. And as Ace opens it, a a um the Beetle Band comes up and plays. You see some it. sort of mummy come out and and, like, and he slams Ace with a big slam, and you're not compelled anymore. Oh, Uggs. But, hey, so I'm gonna need your flat. No. No, I'm not gonna. What's your AC? Not your flat foot, because you don't have. That's 20. And he gets a 24. 22. And, uh, you take 24 damage as he slams you. 24. Yes. And uh, I am gonna need um, a fortitude save for against poison slash disease. What are you going to do me dirty? 22? That is actually enough, and um, you're not affected, and there, there is when we throw initiative. Yay, I'm last. Um. Oh man, can I play even get in? Oh, there is no initiative. Unfortunately not. I'm just gonna use this guy. Oh no! 
Nine. He is gonna get. Fuck! Seventy-two. Uh, actually, seven. <laughs> yes, I'm before him. Yes. <laughs> well, I'm. Uh, and after him. It's uh, it's uh, your turn, uh, Morgenstern. All right. Um. I don't like this guy. Um. So, before I do anything, I wanna I wanna activate my, you know, my my mm. my sheath. Yeah. You um, you like you hold down on onto your like blade and and you kind of make it like kind of ignite a little as yeah. you as you take the blade out. Yeah. And I want to do a power two-handed hit. Power to end it, okay. Hell yeah. That is against this. Holy shit. <laughs> um, this is an undead, so you take. So you get 1d10 extra damage, by the way. Roll d10. Yeah. Oh, she rolled a 13. Goddamn. Oh. Yeah, because you get 1d10 extra against. Uh, against. So, aberrations, fiends, devils, demons, and undead. Yeah. Yeah. So that is um. Holy shit, dude. That's like. Forty-one. <laughs> what? <laughs> Forty. Forty-one? Huh? Okay. Oh hi. I don't think you're joining. Then remember, he actually has the big sword, so I'm I'm good. Oh wait, that's a fifteen to hit. Yeah. Yeah, that doesn't hit. Wow. No. Uh, I, 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 I read touch, not flatfoot. I read the touch instead of flatfoot. Cringe. I can't believe you led me on like this. You're cringe. I'm sorry, dude. But then it's this you're, his you're turn. I could have done 41 damage. You're actually really cringe. Uh, actually incredibly cringe. Like, so can't believe you took this from me. You're so cringe. <laughs> you're such a cringe lord. You're like the, the doors of cringe. Uh, Good night, my lordship. Did I saw ya? Did I saw ya? Nobody to cry with it! My lord. My yeah. lord. Uh, Ace, lord. he's gonna try to hit you once more. <laughs> Why? And that's a, that's a crit. <laughs> yeah, so... Wait! No, it's not, never mind. He <laughs> just cracked me down! <laughs> Sorry, sorry, I, I thought it, it was 90 to 20, it's just 20, okay? It was fun knowing your ace. But you still yeah. take 24 damage. Yeah, I am officially down. And Holy I need shit. a 42 saving throw? A minus 6. Minus 6, 42 saving throw? Yeah, you're good. <laughs> You're just good, actually. <laughs> um, and yeah, it's now uh, Morgenstern's turn. As you see, this mummy, like, uh, you, uh, he, he, like, goes down again and you hit the sarcophagus instead of him. Uh, um. and, and, and then you see, like, gets up again and slaps Ace, and you see Ace, like, <laughs> gets slapped out of the room. Oh. Okay, let me just do a powered heavy attack again. Powered two-handed, I mean. Don't crit. I mean, yeah. Uh, I mean, that's a hit. <laughs> um, and then one d10 extra. Yeah. Oh my god, he's vulnerable to fire. Oh, he's vulnerable to fire. <laughs> yeah, too? He takes, that's great. He takes 50% more. He's a dry mummy. Of course it's one with fire. He's five, made paper. Five divided on two, that's two and a half. Five round down, seven more, so... 42 damage he takes. Ah, I did 42 instead of 41. Poggers. 42 damages. Imagine if that last one went through two. Uh, Would have been beautiful. No. But yeah, uh, it's now his turn. It's like, he, he, he turns around to you and he's like... <gasps> And he gets a hit, cause that's 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 22, and you have 17. Yeah, that's a hit. 
And you take... Uh, 15 damage. Oh, just 15? Yeah. Not more than that? I ask, can Echo stand in here? Like, yes. Queen. Okay, right. well, she stands here, but... I don't have initiative for her. Yeah. But... And then it's and then it's your turn, Morgan, to turn. I'm doing another... Sure. Doing another with power two-handed. Imagine rolling a one. Oh. God damn it. And one d10 extra. That just hits you, lucky motherfucker. <laughs> uh, how do you want to kill him? I want to sever him, like from the top of the head down through his, uh, down through his entire torso. Yeah, you take your sword and use the weight of it to cut like to half of him because. Uh, the sword stops at the sarcophagus, but you notice that when you get about half of him, you see it like you know he, he actually crumbles because of his of this rotten corpse that's been uh, applied just bandages and all. Why is the way you kill your first enemy with a sword the exact way I killed my first enemy with a sword? Because it's a big sword. Because <laughs> it's the that... way to kill an enemy with a sword. Because <laughs> it's a big fucking sword. <laughs> Um, oh hell yeah! Yeah, and uh, let's go. After he like dissipates, take your perception. Oh. And then, and then, and then a praise. Ah, perception and another... a praise. Can I is that what she's Uh, you can only affect an animal's empathy once per day. Can I only do it once per day? On, on a specific, you can do it on another one, but you can only do it once per day per, on, per one animal. Was it perception you said, roll? Perception and then a praise. Woo. Woo. Yeah, um, you're like, you, you see a, um, a, uh, a blue sapphire. Oh, yoink. And a gem encrusted crook. Yoink. And you think that this sapphire is worth around 800, maybe more. And the gem encrusted crook is maybe worth 700, 700 or more. But, like, the thing you're, like, looking at is, is this sarcophagus. It's where, it's like, it's pure gold, so you think that the value of the sarcophagus may be reaching the the, the quadruple digits. No. Oh, can I? How how heavy is the sarcophagus? You can try to get the weight out with a strength check. All right. How much can you lift? I'm just gonna uh. check how much you can lift again. <laughs> It's under equipment and uh, off ground. Um, holy shit! You can lift one ton off the ground. Yeah, I'm a bit of a strong guy. So yeah, you start to lift it, and you know you can, you can, you alone. Like you, you think it's just just about half a ton. Uh. But it, it's kind of it, it's it's kind of like awkward to move around, but you can just move without you. It's like you're literally the limits of your carrying capacity. But you can easily. Right. But you feel like you can easily drag it. All right, I I set it if, back. If 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 you attach some rope. Yeah, I want to set it back, and I want to pick up the sapphire and the gem encrusted crook. Yeah. And I want to put them in my bag. How yeah. much do they weigh? Uh, the gem about five pounds and the uh, crook about t t one pound. I. And you six. also find a sort of a, a, a scarab, but it's not living. It's like made of s some material that you don't know what is. Yoink! What what's it weigh? Uh, you see that this um, beetle—it's—it's it's, it's a beetle-shaped pin that weighs nothing, ah. but you think it's more than a 
just a pin. Yeah, I, I throw it in the bag. Yeah. All right. Uh. And yeah, uh, Ace, I'm gonna need a, a Constitution saving throw. Uh, another one? Yeah, you stabilize. Uh, yeah, Morgan Stern, what do you do? Yes, you, yes, you see Ace, like, 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 he got blasted by this mummy. Um, um. Or he kind of distracted the mummy uh, off you. I'm yoink is blinking over and I'm gonna check his pulse. He's alive. Alright, then I, then I go about wrapping some rope around this this sarcophagus. Yeah. <laughs> I'm just gonna do like this. I'm gonna yoink this bloink on that. And... Ah, he's long. He's a big dwarf. That's a long dwarf, lad. And I'm just gonna let you like that. And yeah, now you can move the sarcophagus around to your will. Augers. <laughs> Good. But yeah. Alright. Uh, uh, then I want to step out here and I want to be big. Yeah. You like Ugh, big. Yeah. I walked down. I want to just pull this guy out. Yeah. This sarcophagus. Uh. So yeah, I'm just <laughs> pulling a goddamn sarcophagus after me. Yeah. This is the easy pull. Like it's no problem. Sick. As long as you're in large size, there's no problem. Sick. If you were medium, it, it would have been like a pop. Wait, yeah. how much can you lift when I'm big? Can I go up to the other cage? Yeah, you go up to the other. You can go up to the other cage, yeah. The other animal that lives. Uh, you see a. Uh, is it here or here? It's 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 two. It's it's the one of the first cages. Just you one? see a. Uh, you see a, um, a Girillon? You what the fuck now? A, a, it's, it's, it's a gorilla, but he has four arms. Okay. But you oh. see that it, this guy, uh, has a sixth arm stitched to it. Ew. On the, on its shoulders. But it doesn't look like you can move, move them around. Okay. And he also kind of backs up to the wall, and it's like, there's no one approach you. Can I attempt to use wild empathy on him? Yeah. He's not a magical beast, is he? Uh, he is. Okay. Then it doesn't work? No, does he have an intelligence of one or two? Two? <laughs> okay, so I only get a plus three. I forgot earlier, but it failed anyway, but... If it's a magical beast, I only get a plus three instead of a plus seven. Yeah, that. Oh, holy fucking oh, shit, dude. Holy shit, dude. Yeah, you're like, you're, you're having no luck with, like, doing anything with these animals. Can I use charm animals on magical beasts? No. No, I'm not gonna do that. Uh, but yeah, uh, after a while, you hear, like, like, the, the same kind of like dragging you heard uh, like a while ago, but it, now it's like it's much heavier and louder. As uh, wait, 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 hold on, hold on, uh, hold on. When I'm large, I can lift this. Yeah, just lift and move it. Yeah, yeah, I just want to like carry it over my shoulder while I'm large, but I keep the ropes around it for in case I need to drag it. Yeah, just because it's, it's simpler. You're, you're, you're moving like half your speed, but half your speed is still fucking... Half my speed is 35. <sighs> God damn it, I forgot. <laughs> my speed is 70. Yeah, so uh, yeah, you, you move at a decent, you move at a slower pace for yourself. Like, you... What the fuck is he playing? A uh, big guy. Big guy. But yeah, yeah. Uh, I use the big uh, guy race and cool guy class. But yeah, more or less, you as you like stand here and try to affect the uh, the animal, you hear you, 
you, you see like through the cages, you know, Mor Morgenstern comes back with a big fucking sarcophagus. No. But he doesn't, but Ace doesn't come with him. Ace isn't I with him. I said him Morgenstern. Oh, hello. I, um, do you think you can help Ace? Oh, he passed out. Oh, yes, of course. And uh, whereabouts is he? Uh, just through the first room here. Up the, uh, up. You'll find them if you just go through the doors. Right. Um, well, I'm having no luck with these animals. Um, these aren't not... animals, they're freaks. Well... Uh, I'm not, at least not ha I'm having any luck with them, so, um, I guess, um, while I'm gone, you do whatever you feel like you need to do. Alright. I just sort of squeeze past them. Yeah, you're like, eh, eh, eh. and yeah, you walk up to, and yeah, you're, oh. when he, he goes there, you're now here. What do you want to, just, where say, does, where does Morgan Stern, like, drag this sarcophagus, so this is like, just do something in this room. Uh, I wanna, I wanna go into this room here. Yeah. And just like I plunk it here temporarily. Yeah. And then I, then I go back to Ace and. Yeah. Uh, while you do that, what did you do, Wolfblood? While Ace was laying down. I uh, talk to Echo. Yeah. You talk to Echo. I say, um. Hello, Echo. Hi. So, uh, Ace passed out, huh? Yeah, big mummy man, or mummy thing, or paper big mummy man thing. Paper thing attack him. He go down. Okay. Well, I guess uh, guess I'll carry him back and patch him up. Yeah, you. I can't do that. You do that. Yeah. Well, you, you can carry him, but you can't patch him up. So. No. Totally fine. No worries, Echo. I'm, I'm skilled in this craft. Here, I'll let you pass. Thank you. <laughs> I go here and I pick Ace up. Yeah, you pick Ace up and uh, big man. Oh! On your way, on your way back, you encounter uh, Morgan Stern coming back into the like the grass room. He's like, yeah, it's sort of keep walking. Need Still some help with that? No, it's totally fine. I walk over and I just grab Ace. <laughs> yeah, you see this. You, I... you see this. This ten foot, ten foot what? Ten foot two. What, ten foot two giant goat thing just go up to you and like just, just kind of like take Ace with one hand off your hand. Let me see. Let me see. Me well. cool. <laughs> huh? Let me see. Huh? Picks me up as well. Uh, yeah, he picks you and so, so I'm holding Ace on my shoulder. I'm not letting him go. Like, I'm yeah, stop him. yeah, he picks you up and just okay. <laughs> I just sort of I pick you up and I princess carry you. Yeah, I just sort of hang in the clutches of Ace. <laughs> <laughs> and I walk. Yeah, I walk into I here. I guess is a pretty decent room to have. Yeah, yeah, yeah he's, he's put the sarcophagus down. down. Oh yeah, and and you see that uh, yeah, they kind of killed the mad doctor that was doing this. You know who he was. Yeah, I'm I'm not complaining. Yeah. Also, you can see that you can see the stones that he had floating around his hand is now floating around mine. Oh. That's a yoinky splinky and a half. Yeah. <laughs> but yeah, what do you guys do? I say uh, just just put him down on that bench there. I'll patch him up. All right. I'm Yoink. walking here. Right, let's see if my heel checks at least are halfway decent. <laughs> Holy shit! What happened? I just go and I sit down on my sarcophagus. Yeah. <laughs> on my sarcophagus. <laughs> it's mine now. <laughs> it's, this is for me when I die. <laughs> 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 Oh my god, I didn't think of that. <laughs> you just go in the sarcophagus and like... <laughs> he just sleeps in it at night. <laughs> I, I, I rest here now. <laughs> From now on I will put my bedroll in the sarcophagus. 
god, that would be so fucking amazing. Imagine, like, like imagine, we... imagine having a yeah. problem with rain, dude. Just line the sarcophagus daily. Dude, Im Im imagine like we, we we could smuggle, we could we could smuggle like things into cities by just putting them in sarcophagus and putting it on the cart. <laughs> <laughs> no, no guard in the right mind would open an ancient old musky sarcophagus. Yeah. Who the fuck would do that? Yeah. Yeah. He'll check. Uh, ace. All right, I I roll heal on ace. Yeah. Pog. Yeah. Um. Wait. No. <laughs> yeah. Um. Do you have a healer's kit? Uh, no, I don't have a healer's kit, but I have a makeshift healer's kit, which I used in my druidic practices. Which is made of uh, herbal medicine and... Uh, well, it, it's basically like a healer's kit, but it's not an actual healer's kit. It's like a healer's kit, but I made it myself, you know? So it doesn't apply the same bonuses as a healer's kit? No. Okay. Yeah. It's, uh, just, for, it's just for lore purposes. Yeah, you think you patch your face pretty good. But you don't right, do can much. I, can I double check? Intelligence? Not perception. Perception? Uh, per instead, yes. Uh, forget, <laughs> don't worry about that one. <laughs> <laughs> worry about that one. Yeah, that, that one. Yes. Like, like after like doing it like like when you're about seventy percent done with like yeah, you know, you're like, God damn it. I didn't do shit. I <laughs> just open him back up and start doing shit. Yeah, but you're like, you, 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 you're like, God damn it! Now I need to work on overtime. Yeah, but that's fine. Yeah. Throw a fortitude I... saving throw first. Me? Yeah. Okay. Huh? Uh, as you're about to like, uh, you're in, you're in the process of doing another and like, doing it over again, you pass out. I haven't rolled above five today. Like two times. <laughs> yeah, it's rolled about ten. Oh, my fucking God. oh what What's happening? Even, even my perception, I have plus eleven. What's Which happening? Means I rolled fourteen on my perception. <laughs> Holy fucking shit, dude! <laughs> Let's hope combat never appears. This day. Holy fucking shit, dude! But yeah, Ace, you heal up seven HP, and uh, you're the first one to wake up, actually. <laughs> With like needles and herbal medicine in your stomach. I have one HP. <laughs> You're like, oh, <laughs> what the? Oh, you have know, like a sewing needle and a thread inside your stomach. <laughs> yeah, there's like a sewing needle in yeah, you. There's and, and like leaves you... all over the place and incense <laughs> burning and shit. When, 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 when you wake and up, he's sleeping on top of his sarcophagus. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, I'm just like laying on a sarcophagus. When you wake up, you see the more, more, uh, more uh, wolf butt. I'm, I'm just not gonna attempt your name, because uh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna say moron. So just many... call me moron. Uh, um, uh, wolf butt is laying on top of you, uh, and it, and it's like holding a needle in his hand and some leaves in his other hand. It's like, I'm like, uh, this, uh, this is so. Um. Yeah, and you know he's 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 sleeping on on like exactly on top of your dick, nah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, pull <laughs> them <laughs> <That's sussy. laughs> No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> That's kind of sussy. Uh, Deku, uh, where's just a sussy baka? The bussy? Don't ever say that again. <laughs> <laughs> I just move a wolf blood, like yeah, I can be there instead. Yeah, you move it like so you like. Just... He's just on top of the cabinet. Could I do a heal slide check of hand. myself? Slide of hand! Slide of hand! God damn it. Yeah, you, you managed to successfully move it. Oh yeah, for resting purposes, I will be medium sized. FYI. Can I, can I heal? Just so I fit do in I the sarcophagus check? better. Yeah. I can do a heal check. Yeah, you can do a heal check. Hopefully, patch my up. <laughs> yeah. I also use a grand shield kit. Yeah. Uh. So you're gonna rest more? 
Yeah, I didn't take a, another rest. Yeah, you take another rest, and uh, Morgan's turn. You're the first. You're then the one to wake up. Ah. Uh, yoink is ploinky. As you wake up, you see that uh, um, Wolfblood is like laying on the cabinet with his needle and some leaves in his hand, and Ace is, Ace is like on the floor, um, and uh, with with some new bandages and stuff. Huh. Actual bandages. I just look at Wolf Blood and like, yeah, he didn't do that. <laughs> and uh, you also gain seven HP back because oh. we we heal one HP per level. Beautiful. We? Besides you, you Wolf Blood, oh my, uh, you heal like uh, sev every night. You heal like seven hundred HP. So. Ugh. Yeah, does Morgan Stern just wait there, or? Uh, I'm a, I'm a just a hop out of, hop out of, hop out of sarcophagus. Yeah. It's not exactly bad. Um, and I'm a go, I'm a go large, cause you know, gotta, gotta get large for the day. Other people get dressed. Me, who doesn't wear clothes, I, I get, get large. large. Imagine wearing clothes, am I right? <laughs> I want to just like have a little look over here. Yeah, you know that like basically the whole uh, facility, and uh, you know, uh, you know, to get to the next level, you gotta take the fucking boat. Yeah. But you know, um, you, you know, you know that. There's something up with the boat, but you don't, not to exact the boat, but you know, you know why they, you have to take a boat, but you don't exactly remember why, because you haven't done that in a while. Yeah. Where's the boat again? Uh, yeah, the boat is like down here. Ah, it's over here. Like over here and down there. Down here? Yeah. I'm walking. I'm like, uh, nothing fucky going on here. Yeah, the boat's still there, waiting for you know, trip back, trip there, you know. Alright. I want to go back and just like wait for the others to wake up. I guess. Yeah. You just roam around, just sleep. just check around everywhere and just check that there's nothing like sussy going on. Check that there's no sussy bakas hi hiding around. <laughs> And uh, Ace, you wake up first. You heal 14 HP as you rest 8 hours more. Uh, ah, hello. 14. Morning. Please, cure that wounds, yes. Imagine rolling a 1. <laughs> oh my god. Yes. Wait, wait. Nidon? Hmm? I have a question for you. Yeah? How far do you need to go in the vampire transition before you become an elf? Uh... Um, do you know why I'm asking Nidon? No. Because undeads don't get healed by cure that wounds. <laughs> take damage from cure life wounds because it's positive Ace, energy. Um, oh no! As you do your cure life wounds on yourself, uh, you knock yourself. You take actually take nine damage. And you're like, ah, what the fuck? Yeah. So, fourteen minus nine. <laughs> it's like five. Yeah. Now that is what I call your inky splunky. You're like, what the hell? Sorry, Ace. <laughs> take a take a knowledge uh, arcana. So how can I heal myself? I can't turn off my DM brain. I'm sorry. 
you know that you f you 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 know that positive energy is for living beings and it harms non-living beings well i can't just you can take a spellcraft actually okay uh You know that if positive energy heals, if cure wounds is positive energy, then there must be a counter spell to it. And you think that maybe your god may possibly have the answer to it? Cyphers! I uh, pray for Cyphers. Do you have knowledge religion? No. Uh, throw a pure what's what's your, what's your spell based on charisma or wisdom? Uh, my spell is based on this wisdom. Then throw a pure wisdom. Okay. Um You, uh, you used to like about an hour on this, but you you kind of reverse craft the cure light wound spell into something called inflict wounds. Mm. So can I just stab myself and heal now? <laughs> no. Do you try this okay. new magic? Uh, I, I'll give it a try. Imagine only a one. God damn it! Jesus Christ! <laughs> You're dangerous. Good rolls today. Good rolls today. Yeah. Thanks. And instead of like um, light and like uh, like yellow kind of radiance come out of your hand, you see a kind of misty. Uh, Gray, bluish kind of energy come out, and you actually heal from this. Yeah, um, what's my healing for today? <laughs> 13 HP, let's go! <laughs> but yeah, uh, and as you do that, uh, Wolf Blood, you wake up. Well, hey guys. Yeah. As you wake up with a needle and then leaf in your hand. Oh, your voice uh, ready, keep moving. Uh, yes, let me just put this away. Oh, hi, Ace. Hi. <laughs> Seems I can't. Oh, yeah, and uh, Morgenstern, you witnessed this? Yeah, I'm sitting watching. So you can, uh, you can also throw a spellcraft. <laughs> I can't heal normally now. What do you mean? Well, you remember all the curse thing. Yoink! Okay. Yes. <laughs> yes. You're like, and you got no clue what the fuck happened. <laughs> yeah. Uh. Well, I'm going to need to do... I can't do <laughs> cure light wounds anymore. <laughs> oh, really? Hmm. Can oh, I do well, like... Yeah. Oh, wait, can I do another... Wait, what's better... Is Knowledge Arcana or Spellcraft better? Knowledge Arcana. Okay. Yeah. Well, one, uh, Ace is either an undead, uh, or he's a living undead. Of right. some sort. Is it an Ace? Well, it sounds like you're either dead or almost dead. Well, that's unfortunate. Well, I... what can I do? Yeah, what can I do? Well, that's about the that, that's about the, the limits of my knowledge about this, I believe. Oh, well, I can I, I can I can can I roll a knowledge nature to tell him that stuff like this doesn't exist in the natural world? Knowledge nature. Holy shit! You rolled a five. Oh my. 
Holy shit! I rolled three. He can. Holy shit! Just fucking tell me I can't do anything today, dude. I don't want to roll anymore. Uh, yeah, this is not natural. <laughs> Tie my hands in Gagby. <laughs> um, I guess we can move, my good friends, yeah, because I... I don't feel dead. I, I don't feel alive. I just say to Ace, well, stuff like this doesn't happen in the natural world. Believe me, I would know. I was, I was born somewhere in the middle between this and the next. Yeah. You don't. I guess also that God doesn't give you just a wolf out of nowhere. Yeah. Well, you, you guys head to like the open cave here, and and, uh, and you drag the sarcophagus, you know? Yeah, I'm carrying it now. How? I mean, as he as he says this, can I ask Echo something? Yeah. I say Echo. Huh? Yeah. Huh? What? Do you know? What you are? Yes. So you know you're not. I'm me. Echo. You're Echo. Yeah. Right. Should have just said I'm dog bark. <laughs> I'm dog. <laughs> yeah. I'm... You, 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 more, more, more. Sure you say this. Arr, arr, woo, arr. <laughs> I'm, I'm big wolf. Big dog. Wait, I, I can't also and then Wolf speak just, with animals. And then Wolfo just barks back. You haven't used all your spells, though. What do you mean? Yeah, yeah. You, you, right. you can't. You can't understand me, though. So I'm not an animal. Wait, what? Even though, even if he can't speak with animals, he can understand. I would you. just make. I would just make animal noises because I'm not actually an animal. The spell wouldn't work on me. True. So even though he can understand what Echo's saying, I'm not an animal, so the spell wouldn't work on me. Well, you technically all creatures that is not uh, in body. Well, technically, I was born half animal because I'm half wolf, but that doesn't count for spell purposes. <laughs> As it's uh, section <laughs> 3, paragraph 24 in the Pathfinder rulebook. Well, you're it. half wolf. Which one of your parents was the wolf? Uh, well, <laughs> we don't talk about that. <laughs> but, uh... <laughs> Wait. Well, we don't talk about Let's just say they were both quarter wolf. <laughs> uh, that's equally as sussy. <laughs> but yeah, so. Um, where is that? that now that's what I call a sussy bussy. You assess the boat and you think that everyone is just gonna fit. But you don't think this what? Are... I think we should leave the dog behind. The, the echo Which was... one? <laughs> Oh, we're walking like, in all fours. If, if, if Morgenstern goes that back to medium, he can fit. And Morgenstern, you think, like, you can't bring this sarcophagus in, it's gonna fucking sink. Um, uh, yeah. I'm gonna just yoink and sploink well, the sarcophagus why don't, why don't over we here take, for a bit. Why don't we take two trips? No, we will leave it here for later. Well, if, if you took a trip when you were medium with the sarcophagus, you could probably make it across. But with... Is it in the sock? You know, I'll just leave it here for later. All right. I well, I, I unwrap the rope. Boy. Yeah. yeah, that's the plan. Yeah, you take your five hundred feet rope away from it. Yeah, and I shrink the medium. And I hop on the boat. Yeah. I sit on the front. Yeah. Uh, echo squeeze. <laughs> echo just manages to like stay <laughs> on the edge. Covers all of us. She just manages just to stay on the edge. Like she should just lay the, the the dog should just lay on the on the boat and we should sit on top of it. <laughs> All right. Well, yeah. are there any are there are there any paddles? Yeah, there is two paddles. No, we okay. paddle with our hands. I I grab a paddle. Yeah. And I go. <laughs> and I roll. Yeah, and the boat just spins around in a fucking circle. You idiot! Idiot! Hold on! Hold on! Hold on! You grabbed one paddle and you went. <laughs> Yeah, no, I grab the paddles, and I go, <laughs> okay, and I go, better. and I go, <laughs> oh, 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 <laughs> You're like, shit, goddamn, holy shit. God. Boat. As you swim over, I want a perception. 
Give the big man screech! <laughs> don't we need to do like, I don't know, strength to hold on to the boat? Nah, don't worry about it's it. It's a this boat. Is like Mach 5. <laughs> don't worry about it. Don't worry about Ooh. it. I'm walking it. I'm walking it. <laughs> 18. I roll. Ah, me roll. too. Um, I five. The steady oh, sound cool. of gently flowing water fills the massive underground chamber. In the center of the of the cavern, a large pool of dark water separates dry shelves of rock to the east and west, <laughs> with a rotting wooden bridge leading from the eastern shore to a small rocky outcropping judging from the pool's surface. To the north, a wooden robot bobs slowly within arm's reach, which, are, which you are on now. Let's go to the left. Yeah. I got a six. I just want to point out that I'm not allowed to roll anymore today. <laughs> I'm, I'm just gonna be here for the ride, guys. The, the dice is cursed. <laughs> <laughs> the, the dice, yes. The entire n network database online. How does it feel, huh? How does it feel? Huh? How does it feel? I'm, I'm not the one cursing my players by saying, imagine rolling a win. <sighs> well, you're the one saying, the imagine rolling a win and also crit. As also, you... why, are we, why are we moving without the boat? Because the boat's not a token. I go too fast. <laughs> oh fuck, we're here. No. <laughs> the boat can't keep up with us. <laughs> the ball is, boat is lagging uh, behind. The sheer, the sheer momentum of his paddles hitting the hitting the water is enough to keep up up with water. Ace, <laughs> as you uh, as you start rowing the boat, you um feel the same kind of rumble you once did in a cave. No. <laughs> no, me does. And... Oh, no. No, 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 no. Wait, wait. No, <laughs> turn back. Turn back. Go back. Go back. As... We roll faster. No! <laughs> no, wait. A stands in front of it. We roll no, straight man. into I... it. Rub you rub the fucker. <laughs> as, rub into it. As this large, big black dragon comes out of the water. Oh, mm. Okay, as he does that, I turn into a wolf before combat starts. Mm. But really he just comes out of the water, and for those who. And as he comes to the water, you see a. Um, he, uh, you see a giant vortex <laughs> appears Ooh. under the boat. Wait, wait, oh. wait! I, I, the gauntlet. I talk to this thing. Is it a dragon? Yeah. You see a giant black dragon. Oh no! I, 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 I try to recall it. What do you say? Wait! <laughs> wait! Stop! <laughs> I scream out. Um, diplomacy. <laughs> You're trying to promise with the dragon, dude. I am going to seduce the dragon Fuck by no. dancing. You're not a bard. I know. He, the vortex stops. And he's like, <laughs> I could have done that too. Off the ship, Just power of my voice. I <laughs> declare he's iconic. <laughs> As this. Sulfur smelling breath comes out of the dragon. It's like, I'm listening. Oh. My good friend. Uh, oh yeah, that's right. Ace is glowing with red eye. Uh, <clears throat> my good friend, we just want to get past. Just to the other side. We don't want any trouble. Uh, why should I allow you to do that? Well, how can it hurt you? I well, my must kindly ask. My life could be on the line. On the line? Sir Dragon, Sir Dragon. Mighty one. I speak Draconic but now, by the way. Yeah. Um, I just want to tell you. We want to pass the lake. Want to go about a business? You can go about yours. Roll diplomacy. Holy fuck! Hi. He's 
like, hmm, I've seen you before, I've let you pass before. I guess I can let you pass. Just, you know, don't tell anything to your honor, and then we'll be good, yeah? Ah, uh, don't worry. She so won't know. You. Huh? What did, you, what did you say? What did you say, uh, Morgan? Oh, so it sounds like a deal to me. It's fine. And he descends back into the water. <laughs> Save guys. Wasn't worse than wasn't harder than that, boys. Jesus fuck me. I, ju I just look at them both like really confused, but also happy that the dragon disappeared. Yeah, you see this dragon like they they're talking in some draconic language and you know, the dragon just nods his head and goes down underwater and you guys pass. I were almost ready to activate my <laughs> gauntlet. Yeah, do you question it, uh, Wolfblood? <laughs> really? Not really. I've seen Stranger Things. Oh, yeah. i also seen <laughs> Make me I've big. Seen, make I've me seen big. I've stranger than that. <laughs> I'm gonna make you big. How, how, how wide is this gap? About 15 feet. But yeah, as you get there, stop! <laughs> Stop! Stop it, please! No! Stop I, it, please. I do Stop a running it. and a leap! Oh, let's go! Oh, I turn into wolf and now over the other side! Bye bye! You, you, you die! I swim very fast! You die! die? You die! <laughs> we wait, even wait. have the new guy to fuck with the DM! <laughs> I swim! So you fast! You see that this rough stone floor uh, of this room is bisected by a 10 foot wide channel, barely containing a torrent of dark fetid water that ripples with oily colors and occasionally emits tiny sparks. Uh, at the western end of the channel, a waterfall plunges from a hole in the ceiling, filling the channel before rushing out through a dark opening in the western wall. The room is thick with mist and a thin sheen of pale fungus coats every surface. Uh, Mor Mor do you try Morgan. To, do you try to get over? Wait, Morgan. Yeah. Could you throw us over? <laughs> God damn it! <laughs> I'd be happy to try. Well, ah! I would gladly let you throw me. Strength check. What are you waiting for then? I walk over to the edge. <laughs> yeah? And I roll my... <laughs> <laughs> I roll the six. Ace, <laughs> he tries to throw you over. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> Splash! <laughs> Oh no. Four to uh, save throw. Oh. I... Yeah, that worked pretty well. I was. Uh... Ooh. Was not hooked. Yeah, 33. And then no, I'm going to. I mean. And do you want to try to get still over? Yeah. Uh, I am going to need a, a swim. Swim. As he does this, I uh, turn into a medium wolf and jump over. Acrobatics. Yes, meaning I have a plus four to my dex. Swim and acrobatics, let's go. Okay, <laughs> you manage to just get it and swim across. And you're like... <sighs> Come on, acrobatics. Uh. <laughs> I, I, I fear for your life. <laughs> oh. I guess, I mean, what was that about here? not rolling anymore? <laughs> maybe you should have thrown him as well. What is happening? Yeah, I think you should have been thrown. You got eight? Is that enough? I swear you. No. Why I, not? You, <laughs> swim check. Hopefully, I can actually swim. Otherwise, I'll be stuck down here literally forever because I can't. I can't die, and I can't be like drown. I'll probably just hibernate. And for, and oh a, no, and a, and I a, fell and in the water. Time and to sleep. I don't want, want a fortitude saving same throw. Is that a good enough. Uh, yeah, 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 that's a good enough swim. <laughs> yeah. Long jump, let's see. Uh, it's disease. So you get a plus. But Indeed. that's not enough. And as you get out of the pool, you take one constitution damage. Alright. Okay. Echo. It's your turn. Echo is going to leap over. And as
as you get over uh, Ace and uh, War Wolfbird, I want you to take a perception check. Alright. Two oh, like perceptive characters on this side of fucking... Okay, okay, Rock. while while they're doing that, can I... Okay, so if I sprint, how far do you think I can jump? <laughs> you know, you can jump over if you get enough acrobatics. Yeah, I'm just thinking if I build enough momentum, it should be easier, right? I mean, my run is 280 feet. Oh, I, I, I'm going based on ev that everyone took a running start. Yeah. I mean, like, especially with the fact I run really fast. Yeah. So yeah, I'm going to try and hop over. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> you also oh. fall in the water. What? You egg <laughs> just fall in the water, swim. Alright. Long jump is I just swim. Long jump. Let's Maybe hope I can swim. If not, I'm gonna drown and die. Oh, it seems I can. Yeah. As you get up, I almost need a fortitude saving throw. Let's see. That's all. And this is what I told you about the. You see that? That's a normal square before going in the stream. Now, this is a normal square in here. I hate this map so even! Holy fucking shit, you rolled two nat once? Yeah, uh, you yeah. you'll take one constitution damage. One. Okay, one let's damage. see. What what does the sprint say? Uh, if you success a seed, you, you land your feet at the far end. If you fail the check by less than five. Okay. As you jump over, um... Uh, Echo, come on! You don't see some room, for Echo. You, you don't see you don't see goblins. You uh, you see something else. Uh, they're not goblins. Echo, come. Yeah, I push her and then jump. <laughs> those are some big ass goblins. Yeah, those are some big ass goblins. They're not goblins, okay? Those are some boglins. Echo sprints and jump. Big ass goblins. You. See a Yo, lobster like you see a lobster like creature with a f has a, that has a thick armored shell and a pair of tiny eyes gleams over a mouth full of writhing tentacles. They're and, and, kind of thick, though. and you see that these like start to like crab over to you. Are there two of them? There's two of them, and they slowly start walking to you. Right. Wait, how, I, are, are uh, they? Are they? Never mind. They actually start to charge you as uh, they're actually um, bigger than you. An so, echo jump. They're um, long. They're they're very I, large I, crab. I alter my size to large wolf. Yeah. And I charge and at need, this. And I'm gonna need initiatives. Come the come the fuck over. Yeah, that's exactly what they look like. It's the crap people. Does the check succeed? Uh, they they they, they kind of they kind of look more like this. No 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 no. They look like crab people from South Park. Oh. I guess. Do, do they get over? Or Echo? Uh, Echo does. Yeah. Get over. Boom. No, but she like gets this. over in the next round. Ah, okay, I just is. she's just floating midair. Oh, well crab! Initiatives. Yeah. Uh, oh, no. crab! <laughs> I just roll initiative. So, Echo. Ten. Ten. Let's see. Yeah, that's good. Okay, yeah. first up, it's uh, Wolf Blood. Wait, I'm before the crabs. Yeah. All right, I. Uh... I guess I'll charge at the crab. Yeah. And uh, I will uh, bite, bite, claw. No, bite, claw, claw, I mean. Yes. I have two arms, not two mouths. Uh, bite. Does 18 hit? It does not. Okay, a claw. Does 25 hit? Yes. Nine damage. Oi! And he's not a humanoid, right? No. Okay. And then I claw! Miss. And now, it's... Uh, where's Ace? 
finished it. I don't have. Oh, yeah. You know I'm live. <laughs> then it's uh, Echo. No, Echo comes next round. Uh, yeah. Then it's Morgan's turn. Um. Bonks. Uh, I'm a I'm a power two handed this bitch ass. Yeah, and they count towards your um, one d ten plus. Huzzah! That hits, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah that hits. <laughs> oh my god. Shoosh. Uh, actually, take your big sword and slice him pretty hard in the shell. Um, and then it's their turn. They turn around with their big crabby crabbies. And they... One claw! That's a real hit. quick, real quick, Two. real quick. Why do these crabs look like goblins? Because they're crablins. <laughs> Two claw! Did you just say touche, but with claw at the end? Crit! Against the uh, wolf blood. What? No, 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 not against Wolfhood, against the. Uh, um. Against uh, Morgan. Me? Yes. Morgan Stern? That's sussy. Oh, God, all the cards fell into me backpack. God damn it. Sucks to suck. Sucks to suck. None of them are bent. Nice. <laughs> Ace is like. Doo -doo 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 -doo. I have yeah. 13 HP! How am I supposed to do this? <laughs> who should I help? The one who can regenerate? Uh, of a, in a, uh, okay. <laughs> no, he's dead. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> you... Uh, take... Uh, so, uh, Wolflet... You take... Uh... Goblins. I take both the goblins. 20 damage. Correction, I take 18. And then, what is your CMD? My CMD... 1 million. 21. That is... Oh, funny number. That is a uh, 32 on CMB, so your grab... Uh, I, I meant the 41. Uh, oh yeah, sorry. It is... <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, and you're, and, you're now gr and, and, and you're now grabbed. All right. And um, Morgan, uh, you take... Fucking don't hit me. Double damage. You take 28 damage. Ah, oh, fuck. And they do not manage to grab you because I don't think a 16 enough is enough to grab you. I have three hit points. Ah, yeah. <laughs> oh, I have oh, no. three hit points. Yikers. Okay. Uh oh, that's mighty sussy. Come on, Ace. And, and it's now Ace's turn. Ah, oh, finally. Oh, I am right. suffering. <laughs> who uh, do I see who uh, who looks worse? The one who has regenerated. The goat man looks pretty bad, you know. He just got really fucking. I usually look really good. That's why you can tell. Yeah. He's just. You see lava uh, spewing out of him? No, I'm just, <laughs> I'm just... <laughs> no, just, just kidding. A Ace. Um... You see really Should dark, I? dark blood spew at it. A ace runs up here. Attack opportunity! No. I not in the rage. That is, uh... 20? No, that's not that it. That does. <laughs> um, oh yeah, I also activate the gauntlet. You also take... You also get another one, hit another hit, and you take, uh... Uh, like... Never mind, he doesn't have any attack, but fuck. Yeah, it's your turn. 
And you activate your gauntlet to do what? I, uh, uh, fuck, um, uh, uh, I use my, um, I use my boost to boost my constitution. <laughs> yeah, you boost your constitution. No, no, not my constitution, my charisma. With how much? Four. Four. All, all to charisma, okay. Yeah? There we go. Wait, why charisma? You know why. God, no. Yes, oh, you know. Oh my god, I know. <laughs> I know. Okay. okay, now I can at least take two hits. <clears throat> and then, he's, um... Uh, fuck. Uh... Uh, grabs his uh, a keys axe. <laughs> yeah, but wait, why? Wait, why charisma? Now wait, wait. Now I don't know. You said last session that I my cons instead of putting constitution as uh, HP. Oh, I that's did. why your constitution modifier is charisma. I forgot. Yeah, that's why I also wrote <laughs> that the stuff changing about vampire. <laughs> <laughs> I forgot. <laughs> Yeah, uh, and then you do take our keys axe. And then I... Oh, well, I grab both my axes. Um, uh, are they flat-footed? Because... Yes, they are. Okay. Hmm. Good to know. And then I... Uh, should I... I use... Uh, normal attacks. <laughs> no! Uh, Furana strike. Yeah. On the creatures and then attack. Please. Uh. <laughs> that one good hit. <laughs> Does any of them hit? <laughs> I mean, the last one hits, depending on what the crit card says. I mean, what if you knock yourself out? Yeah, but. I'm so bad at it, I love it. I love it. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, no. What? Um, as you swing to, t <laughs> to the crab, um, that's slashing, right? Yeah. It's slashing. Yeah, uh, as you um, you swing to the crab, the crab uh, hits your hand, making the swing go wild, and it hits... Uh, <laughs> and it, it, it's my balls. No, it hit Morgan. <laughs> no! No! Oh, <laughs> Morgan, you take 30 damage. Quite negative 10 it is. Oh yeah, you also do take sneak attack now. No, he, he do actually doesn't. <laughs> no, I, I choose to do sneak attack. Just <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, the second attack hits though, and does 13 damage. And uh, how, how do you kill this thing? I... I... Severely... I, I, I cut it off its cloth and... Picks up the call and jabs in the face. Yeah. Morgan, you just see Ace like comes in and swings, and you see the claw, kind, uh, the crab kind of hits his axe away, and it, the axe like goes out of his hand and hits you just as you. Uh, and, and the last thing you know, see is that the axe is on, on the way to you, and then you know, drop. You drop. <laughs> um, it's now Morum. Wait. Can I do one thing? What? Stabilize? Yeah, sure. I stabilize him. Okay. I oh, tend wow. to bite and claw the arm that is grappling me. Yeah. You're stabilized now, big man. Oh, uh, yeah. <laughs> poor, poor Morgan. Fucking. That Fucking wasn't crap. even the crab, dude. <laughs> Which means you're at zero. Wait, yep. Wait what? Yeah.
Doesn't the... stabilize do that? Yeah, it does. Stabilize Pathfinder. Wait, this is also wrong. Your phone casting, you target a living creature I want to discharge. Uh... No, you just stopped the bleeding. Yeah, okay. Then I mistake it probably with something else. Uh, the bite does not yeah, hit. The, the bite of 87? Why doesn't it hit? Because that's not enough. What sort of minuses do you get from grappling? No, you don't have any minuses, it's just not enough. Yeah, if it goes over. Okay. Okay, okay I, I guess I'll claw them. Also, I, I forgot to... <clears throat> this is why I wanted separate character sheets, because I always forget to change my strength score and my dexterity score. Oh yeah! Fifteen does not hit. Twenty-one does not hit. Ooh! Eleven? Five? <laughs> what do you mean five? <laughs> Uh, then next up is Echo, as she gets over. She, I need to command her. I need to command her. <laughs> Manda, I need to do? Command? Hello? Command? Command? And I'm handy? Yeah, I need... Yeah, okay, I do, I do, that's a... I don't, I, it's, I don't think Echo's trained to fight against Aberration. Push them. Oh! You, you lucky motherfucker. <laughs> uh, 29. Yeah, you push Echo to fight the creature. Oops. She goes yes. in to melee. Yeah. She takes attack opportunity. And she takes six damage. Six damage. Uh, do the shit down. Yeah. Twenty-seven. Oh. No. What do you mean? She has twenty-nine. Yeah. This thing has a morale bonus since this friend died, so it's twenty-five AC actions. Nah. <laughs> <laughs> she has over a million, and uh, she's going to bite. With yeah. All with all her force, which equals a power attack. Ah! Ah! Does it hit? Yeah, it hits. Yay! <laughs> Does she eat? No. Fuck. But it's now. She trips now. Just kidding. <laughs> uh, your turn. My turn. Ah, oh, yes. Uh. It used up all his attack of opportunities, right? Yeah. I move here. Or did he? I move Sh there. D you move, you move? Or you fire yeah. shift? Oh, wait, isn't it? Wait, isn't it scale differently? Yeah, the map's not symmetrical, okay? So. Okay, yeah, then this, a fire foot shift. This is a fire shift. Yeah, then a fire foot shift. Because I thought it was different. <laughs> Yeah. Uh, yeah, and then I attack again. Go for it! I see cold. Echo bite. Um, no. I see Echo bite at him and rips off a, 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 bit, a chunk of him. You go in oh. and do the finishing move. <laughs> Woo! Whoa, ace! Yay! Alright! <laughs> How do you kill this the creature? Uh, I guess you know it's it's a lobster, so I uh, cut out this insides and make a uh, good uh, what's it called <laughs> a good meal out of it. You know. <laughs> yeah, you you manage to open up the inside, just ripping it apart. Yeah. Yeah. And now we have food. Mm. Yeah. Um. As, as you rip through two of the crabs, uh, you see uh, Morgan like just laying on the ground. Being stabilized? Uh, I, I, I rush him. With an axe in his uh, shoulder. Which axe is it? Is it a key? 
no. Okay. Not a keys. I grab the axe like I do I do a heal check before I <laughs> grab the axe so yeah. I don't end up opening another wound. Yeah. I'll be right back, guys. Yes. But, yeah. Yeah. Do you do you do you do you do you do you cure series with like wounds? I can't. I don't have that. No, no, no. But not spell. I mean, like, do you do the heal? Oh yeah, yeah. So you, like, you spend one hour and then you add. Yeah, I do that with the med kit. I yeah, so you ma you manage to do that, uh, and you guys wait there for an hour, I guess. And. Um, Treat deadly wounds, yes. Uh, yeah, also deactivate and figure before. Yeah, you are exhausted. Yeah. Like expected. Jesus Christ, it's raining. Uh. Yeah, so uh, one hour goes by, and um, and Morgan, you oh. heal, uh, yeah, I heal seven HP plus his wisdom modifier. Oh. What's your wisdom modifier, Ace? My wisdom modifier is two. Oh, I'm just at negative one now. Nice. And he healed. How much did he heal? Nine. Oh. Nine. 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 Yeah. I do an I do another heal check. You can't do it only once per day. Oh, okay. But uh, you, you you can you can do a rest and do the 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 normal the normal like eight hour long care. Can I I tr I try to make him comfortable. Yeah, you put out the yeah. bedroll and uh, get him to like a comfortable place. I just, um, as this goes on, I just tell Ace, you guys rest up. I'll keep you guys safe for uh, however, however, however long you need. Yeah, uh, I guess I, I'm going to take care, uh, and I also need a rest myself. Mm. <laughs> I'm also going to grab a brownie. Be right back. Can I squeeze in here? Yes, I can. Do you go in? Down, you see, you see, you see a flight of stairs, flight going, of stairs? going down. And here, what's there, here, you see that this this door uh, opens into an empty space with an enormous cylinder, twenty five feet across. Narrow stone blocks float magically in the tube center, unconnected and unsupported, creating a spiral staircase to that to the floor sixty feet below. And down there is nothing actually. So down here is nothing. No, it's just the wall. Okay. I go here. So there's no other ways in Besi here? Besides there. Or jumping across the gap. Yeah. Okay, so they'll, they'll be pretty safe here. Yeah. Okay, uh, I guess I will... Can I fit down the staircase even though I'm large? Yes, but it would be risky. Oh yeah, I guess I'll turn into a small wolf then. Do you go down the staircase? Yes. All the way down? All the way down. You go all the way down and I I am gonna need a acrobatics. Alright. Now, since I turned into small wolf, that's going to be a plus four, even though it doesn't actually matter because I'm still going to roll uh, one, that two, or one, or like zero. Let's see. Uh, that means I have a twenty in total. That's a plus five. Uh, Oh yeah, I also patch myself. Can I patch myself up? You can do multiple people at once. Okay. I'll try to do myself. Yeah, roll yeah. a heal check. Alright, uh, I will... Yeah. Attempt this acrobatics, come on! <laughs> 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 
you are not used to like falling stairs, so you <laughs> you fall, start to fall. Try uh, to grab onto one of the stairs. Reflex. You do not manage to uh, grab uh, the ledge, unfortunately. Ah. Uh? Or any type of stairs. And you take... Uh, you take... Six... Six D10 damage. You take a hundred D6 damage. Eighteen damage as you fall down. Oh, no. <laughs> Not more. <laughs> give me... Give me eighteen seconds. <laughs> But as you fall all the way down, yeah. something attacks you. <sighs> Roll the combat music. <laughs> okay. Um, I am gonna need Can a. I'm gonna need a person. Can I just pop in to see? Uh... No. No. Never mind. I want to see the combat. I want initiative, yeah. Where did I have to go to sleep? Just checking something. And I'm, I'm gonna need a perception. From? And you don't smell anything. Echo sense the danger within him. <laughs> no. Okay. How will that signal of um, bringing the pack together? Okay. This is two. Alright, uh, I have to roll initiative. Yeah. And then a perception. Yeah, I'm just gonna. Where is Moron? There is. What you get on your perception? On? Fourteen. You do not see what attacked attack you. As you take. Uh, seven damage. Seven. Mm. And it's, you don't you don't smell anything. Okay. Um. But uh, you just sense a force of hulking mal malevolence 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 malevolence. God, thank you. Um, that is undeniable in this in this creature's pres presence. I guess I will uh... I, I, do, do I know where it is? No, that that's the thing you trying to do yeah. with the perception. But you can yeah. use your whole you can yeah, you can use your turn to do a per another perception if you want. I mean I guess I'll have to. Yeah. Uh roll over the Yeah, after looking one more time, you can see this, like, s s small, like, it's very hard to 
spot, but you can see this small outline of something bulky. And you now have a target. Yeah. Alright. What do you do? Did I use my turn? You use turn? your standard, use your move action to do that. Okay, I guess I'll attack. Yeah. Uh, hang on, I just had to find out um, what the attack damage thing is that, uh, is that natural. That's what I'm trying to do. Find out what the die is on this. I think it's 1d4. So not large. Yeah, so it's 1d4 and 1d3. This is gonna take a while. <laughs> oh? What are you gonna do? Yeah. I'm gonna I'm gonna bite and claw him to the dice, but I don't know how much health he has. To I get uh, bites. Hit. And then I claw. Miss. Miss. Okay. Is he humanoid? No. Uh, you hit the first time, and your round ends, but nothing else happens. Do you try to find it again? Perception. Perception. Or no, actually, I just, I just, I just go. Go where? I run. Up the stairs? Is, is there no like room anywhere in here? There is, but the door is locked. Okay. Uh. Like, like locked, locked. Locked, locked. Can I do perception to see how like solid the door is? Yeah. Perception. It's pretty fucking solid. Okay. Yeah, I guess I'll just uh, you know I'll 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 walk like halfway up the stairs, mm -hmm. and then I'll do another perception to see if I can find it again. Yeah. With the bird's eye view. It looks like it disappeared. It looks like or did it? It looks like it disappeared. Fuck you. I go back. Yeah. Bro, not that way. This way? No. No, I gotta move, move you back to the other map. <laughs> okay. Yeah. You, you're yeah, back like, now. None of these rooms look like the one I was in. <laughs> and uh, you come back and you see that Ace uh, has put some dressings on himself and Morgan. And they're now resting. Your Vicky is glowing key. I just, uh, I light a fire. Yeah. Uh, I like, I move this thing. This thing. Yeah. This thing. I like, yeah, and then I light a fire right here. Yeah. No, don't move them away. I'm gonna make some goblin crab meat. <laughs> it's just a crab, it's not a goblin. It's a crablin. Stop. <laughs> but yeah, you put the. You make a fire. Do you have yeah, a professional. Survival. Okay. Armor survival. Survival. Yeah, you, you you make an edible crab. Not not a good like it's pretty fucking bad, but it's it's edible. Yeah, it's better than nothing. Yeah. And I eat some. Yeah. And then I did, did I did I use all of it at once or did I just make for myself? Uh, all of it at once. I guess. 
because I was gonna say I, I was gonna save like half of it for when they wake up. Could have specified it then. Yeah, but holy oh, shit! I didn't <laughs> think I didn't think I was actually gonna make like two tons of crab meat at once, dude. It's not even two tons. What do you mean? They're both large crabs. Yeah, they're not heavy. Oh shit! Do you, do you, do you even know? What's the minimum weight in the large size cat for this? These are only like 200 kilograms. What do you mean? The minimum weight is 500 pounds in the large category. Yeah, and these the are fuck two, up. and these are 400. Yeah, and the minimum weight is 500. For character, so, you're so cringe, dude. For characters, it's fun. you're really cringe. Ah! You're super fucking cringe. You're Shut like a cringe lord. There are 400 pounds in this air! <laughs> You're so cringe. But yeah, 8 hours go by and Morgan, you heal for... I'm already full health. <laughs> Are you 20, what now? 21 hit points of damage. Wow, I'm at... And Ace, 20. you also heal 21 hit points of damage. That's ah. a funny number. Um, I also rest. While they, uh, yeah. rest. And, uh, you wake up, all of you. Ah. <sighs> Is my con damage gone? One con oh. damage gone. Yeah. How are you feeling? <sighs> Did my medical work go uh, out handy? Seems to have helped. I mean... Didn't help that you hit me with an axe in the first place, did it? <laughs> well, you know... Sometimes you overshoot, and uh, other times a crab hits your hand, and then you hit your friend. Ah, truly. Truly. So, Wolfblood, I see you're back. What did you find? find much it was like a something bit me and then I bit it and it went away and there's a pretty big fucking door down there and I uh, didn't have any more energy so I couldn't try to break it open but I think that me and Morgan could do it get together all right meanwhile I made some uh, Pretty awful crab meats, but it's at least it's like semi edible, uh, just to fill just to fill your stomachs. Uh, I suggest drinking some, drinking something with this box. It's pretty dry. Uh, that's the best. I, I remember do. having a cook on our, in my group. Yes. Yeah. I also remember having a cook. It was that was good times. Yeah. Well, yeah. we don't now. No, we don't. I also had a very. Sh we also had a horse. It uh, kind of looked like a god, to be honest. You, you had a horse. A horseman, yes. Oh, fascinating. Yeah, which also seemed <laughs> to have sex with a fox lady. Okay, I'm glad I killed him. Shit, what? Wait, no, wait. I didn't kill him, I just found a sword on him. I mean, <laughs> yeah, I, I mean, okay, wait, wait, wait. I, 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 mean, was first, gonna dude, I only killed the other guy. If... I only wait, wait, killed the other guy. Can... Yeah. Right, so you, you are saying that. If Burjak was still alive after he was stabbed in the throat, dude. Yeah, he only killed the other guy. <sighs> oh. Wait, did you kill an old man? I found this fisher looking fella. You know. He looks like a fish. <laughs> you, you mean Ilion? Or. Or. Uh, what's it called again? Uh, John. Or Bob. I think. Listen. listen. Uh, I... To troll intelligence check, Ace. What's the answer? <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> like, you don't know his name, but you know there was, you know, 
you, you know that you found two corpses. Uh, there was two corpses when you found no one additional corpse when you found Project. And then and Christian fella. Yeah. So why did you kill him? I mean, it was mainly to put him out of his misery, wasn't it? Didn't look like it was having a good time. I wanted to do a sense reference, but I won't. Wow. <laughs> well, I mean, he... He was human, and he was quite old. I guess it was the right choice. But, well, we got patched up and all. Should we continue on? Adventure. Get up, stomp out the fire, and lead the way. E, let's go. Say, watch out, they're, they're pretty tricky, these uh, rocks. I'm sure Ace can handle them very well, but I'm not that sure about Morgan Stone. You might want to turn medium for this. Wait, how is uh, Echo like going to get idea. that? Shrink me. <laughs> what, what, what do you say, Ace? Shrink. <laughs> well, get shrunk. Shrink. I will now Back. become a fine I want to become creature. small. Yes. I will go into minuscule size. Goodbye. <laughs> I turn into the... I, I, I go between the atoms. I become it's fine size. Realm. Goodbye. Alright. Ace is fucking blind. <laughs> no, it, it's all the way at the top. Oh yeah. Now I can see. Yeah. <laughs> Confused me. Oh. If air. that's not a yoink and a sploink. Yeah, yeah I'm gonna need all of you. I'm gonna need the uh, acrobatics. Oh, fuck. As you go With my down. record, I'm gonna take more damage, dude. <laughs> why would, yeah, why did, you, did you did you know damage? if I if I if I concentrate hard enough, I get plus oh. acrobatics. Holy shit! How? How? Every oh, well, nice. time, dude. Reflex save. Holy shit! Dude, I got a nat 20 on my reflex save and it didn't even matter. Why am I throwing reflex? Acrobat. Can I do a reflex to catch him? No, because... Huh. Yeah, what do you mean uh, by every, no? everybody besides Echo and uh, Morum, they don't get to catch him. Well, if I'm fast enough, I can. No. Um, Echo and Morum, reflex save on Echo. Uh, you take, uh... What are we doing reflex save for? Two... Yeah, cause I got a 30, and it didn't even matter. Wait, reflex save... Where? 30 reflex save? Where? Earlier, when I was down here by myself. Yeah, you got 30. Wait, did I see that wrong? Yeah, I got a 30! I got a nat 20 on my reflex save! <laughs> Wait... Wait, oh I, oh, I read the reflex save as 11. <laughs> yeah, then you didn't take damage then. I'm sorry for the well, misunderstanding. It doesn't matter because I healed the fool after like one minute. Yeah, Echo and Moron take 20 damage. Okay. As they fall down. Yeah, Echo died. And as you guys are about to uh, go out and like to the door. Wait, what do you mean? Huh? Not actually, right? No, no, I'm just... This, okay. this, this, this <laughs> is gonna be like... I think this is where we're gonna end the session. No! no. Yes! No! Yes! You've only been going for like room. one hour for one minute. <laughs>